That's my ring modulator period. <laughs> and I suddenly decided that if you kept the, the bass line really simple and then played the top line through the ring modulator, it would get all sorts of weird effects, but not detract. You know, you talked before about something sounding a bit weird when you multiplex. Same with the ring modulator. If you put the wrong notes together, it sounds horrible. It's hard to work out what worked well on the ring modulator because you can do it on air, some stuff sounds pretty enough with the ring modulator. But uh, the Sidship, it was just phenomenal the way the, the two channels interacted. But the nice thing was one of the channels was just normal and the other one was affected. And so as long as you kept that uh, modulating channel pretty simple, you got some fantastic stuff on the other channel. That was the bass line, and I saw it. I got, I got fed up with it as a bass line, I thought that's the sound. And I thought, I tried as a the thing, and I thought that sounds really good now. So I wrote a new bass line. So it, it, it took me weeks and weeks and weeks just tweaking it. Just. This goes out, I would really like to thank all the guys who do remixes. I think they do a fabulous job. There's some great stuff. That, that really is a, a, a tribute and a half when people actually, you know, copy music. Imitation is the sincerest form of flattery. And quite often they do a lot, they do a lot better than I do, I think. 